morning and welcome to Sunday. Um, <clears throat> the last you would have seen was us doing some blueberry picking and then um, going off to Powell's for a visit, which I will share some of the books we got. Um, I had fully intended on filming in there, but <laughs> I was so engrossed in looking at books that I completely forgot and walked out realizing that I did not take a single clip. So I apologize for that. But we picked up some pretty cool books. Um, and then that was Friday. And then yesterday was not really a good filming day. I was doing a major cleaning and organizing job down in the basement of all of our um, extra stuff, all my like childhood stuff that we have storing downstairs in my mother-in-law's house um, for the time being. So it's just dark and not good lighting down there and it would have been very boring footage of me trying to go through every single item that I own down there and reorganizing and cleaning it all. So decided not to film um, yesterday, but <clears throat> we're back again today. I still have a little bit of um, stuff I need to go through um, for one dresser that I have down there with more of like my art shop stuff um, that I will work on today. Did some plant watering and cleaning up the studio a little bit this morning. Um, and then for the rest of the day, I'm trying to think. This evening we are going to go um, over to my brother and sister-in-law's house. Um, they got a new kitten, which I'm excited to see. And then uh, we also, it's my sister-in-law's birthday today, and it was Jake's birthday a couple of days ago. So we're going to celebrate both their birthdays by going out to dinner in um, downtown Portland, which is exciting. So we're going to do that this evening. Um, but first, got to do some work. Um, and... Let me real quick show you the books we got from Powell's. It's a little stack. Um, first is this really old vintage book called The Song A Song of Life. And it's a bunch of like nature stories, I think, about um, just different parts of nature and their song that they bring to the world which is just really unique. Um, I was gonna look at the date that this book was printed. 1902. That is an old book. So this was really cool to find. Another old book it's called The Kingfishers. It's uh, another nature story about these two birds, the Kingfishers, um, and someone's observations of them and their interactions with other wildlife. Um, I believe that this was translated from Russian to English, so um, they've got some beautiful watercolor paintings inside. I'll show you some um, flip throughs through it because it's a very beautiful book. It's another old one. And then another old one is called A Season of Birds. It's someone's like called the Norfolk Diary in, from 1911 um, and it's uh, for every single day of the year they noted what bird they saw um, and then there's some beautiful artwork to accompany, accompany it so that was a really cool find and another quite old book the year this was published. Let's see. 1980. So another old one. This was a super cool find. Um, an old anniversary edition of The Giving Tree. That was a book that I definitely grew up reading when I was little by Shel Silverstein. Um, it's a beautiful anniversary edition of it. Um, <clears throat> this one, 1992, oh wait, no, 1999 was this 35th anniversary edition, and it had this own little case, really cool find, 
And then lastly, um, I found this children's book of the first chapter, I believe, of The Wind in the Willows, um, The Riverbank. I believe it's the first chapter of the whole book, but this is just that single chapter and it has some lovely, lovely illustrations. I'm going to have to show you them. And um, the cover and binding is just absolutely beautiful as well. I was so shocked to have found this and guess what? It was only $2.50. I am still shocked at that. Um, this was 1977. Panels! Amazing! Thank you! <laughs> I'm so stoked about this find to add to my children's book collection. Um, so those were the books we got and picked up at Powell's the other day. Um, now let's finish up going through some of that stuff from downstairs and then I'll get to some computer work. So let us go friends and get to work.